Hello everyone, I'm Rhino Clavin with your Diz Daily Fix for Thursday, October 26, 2017. Here's what's happening today. First up in early 2019, Disney Cruise Line will embark on an exciting array of tropical itineraries to popular worldwide destinations that include the Bahamas, the Caribbean, the Mexican Rivera, I can't speak, and Baja, Mexico, and there's even a uh, 14-night cruise that will take you from Port Canaveral to San Diego through the Panama Canal. It sounds pretty cool, but there's a lot of days at sea for that one. But um, So the best part of all this is that if you are a Disney Cruise Line uh, Castaway Club member, you can reserve these new cruises before the general public can on November 2nd, uh, one week from today. So uh, Platinum members, you can start reserving starting October 30th. Gold members, you're, you can begin to reserve on the 31st. And Silver members on the 1st, while the general public starts on the 2nd. Uh, for more information on the itineraries, all those cruises, you can head over to www.info.com to check out some more information on that or contact a Dreams Unlimited travel agent at dreamsunlimitedtravel.com um, and they'll, I'm sure they'll be happy to get you on your next Disney cruise. Uh, so next up, the Disney Parks blog has shared that Innoventions will be adding the Spectacular in November. Um, the Spectacular will invite guests to join a group of real scientists and their tech-savvy intern for a series of thrilling experiments that put scientific principles like ultrasonic pressure, barometer, barometric pressure, I'm clearly no scientist myself, you know this, uh, acceleration and force to the test. It's been said that the show will be funny and fascinating. Guests of all ages will be able to participate too. So uh, the new show is sponsored by Murata, a global leader in the design, manufacture, and supply of advanced electronic components and Science from Scientists, a nonprofit organization that aims to improve STEM literacy at school. STEM is what I said there. It's all Spider-Man to me, but um, finally, uh, next month, the Disney Channel will be introducing a gay storyline into the second season of its very popular series, Andy Mack, marking a first for the network. Um, so gay characters have been featured in single episodes of shows on the Disney Channel, like Good Luck Charlie um, and apparently Doc McStuffins as well. This will be the first time, though, that the story of a main character comes to the realization that he or she is gay and then kicks off their journey to self-discovery and ultimately self-acceptance as a gay individual. So, um, for those of you who don't know, Andy Mack focuses on a 13-year-old girl by the name of Andy and her interactions with her family and her two best friends, Cyrus and Buffy. With a uh, medium viewer age of 10 years old, Andy Mack is the number one series this year among girls and top rated in its time period among kids 16, 6 to 14. The second season premiere of Andy Mack is set to air this Friday at 8 p.m., so you might want to check it out. Now, over on the Diz Today, our featured article comes from Ryan Teets, and it is the rumor roundup for October. These are always a fun read, so be sure to head over to www.info.com to check out that article. Many other great ones on there. Uh, trending on the board today is the thread where posters are discussing the chance of not being able to get back into a certain theme park on the same day um, once they've left due to capacity issues. Uh, this happens a lot during the holiday season, uh, the last two weeks of the year here. Uh, it's it's a very popular time to visit. So uh, the thread is entitled Leaving Parks and Can't Get Back in Fears. Uh, it was started by poster Smahani6 uh, and can be found on the Theme Parks, Attractions, and Strategies Forum at disboards.com. Now it is Thursday and that means there is an episode of the Universal edition of the Diz Unplugged and this is our spooky Halloween episode this week where we're going to be answering all of your questions. If you want to know what we dressed up as well, you're just going to have to check out that episode uh, youtube.com slash disunplugged disunplugged.com or on iTunes where you won't be able to see us but I'm sure we talk about what we are now finally everyone's favorite part of the day the weather uh, out in Anaheim the, the heat is finally starting to break with highs for today and tomorrow just below 90s with lows um, right around 60 on both days uh, here in Orlando it's beautiful weather gorgeous uh, today with a high of 76 low in the mid 50s just wonderful tomorrow it's going to get a little bit warmer with a high in the uh, high of 80 and a low in the mid 60s but there is some cooler weather on the horizon next week as well so for links to everything that was discussed in today's Diz Daily Fix you can visit the Daily Fix main page at www.info.com slash Daily Fix that is going to do it for me I'm going to go enjoy this beautiful day I hope you all have a great day